What is that wall? Am I out? Alright, it's cookie time. Sick. I'm not giving up. This man is going to do it. This green man. Piccolo. Piccolo. Piccolo's getting this kill. I don't care. Alright. Alright, it's already over. Piccolo, no. No. <gasps> no. No! <laughs> this is the worst game. No, Piccolo, I don't know what it is. I feel like his punches are just bad. He has bad frame data. He has no flow. Sad boys. We'll use him for the third one. I swear. See how easy that was? Yeah, Drone's like the only one that does that. Drone Android 19, who's already dead. And he's easy, so. I swear Jero is like the hardest enemy in this game because he's not gigantic. His hitbox, his hurtbox is so small. Piccolo's just slow. I think that's what it is. Look how fast I can move with Vegeta. Piccolo doesn't have that. He doesn't have the spacing. time. I should have saved this one for last, but this is the really bad one. Also, see Vegeta has clutch. I wasn't scared for a second. If I was Piccolo there, I would have been I would have given up. There are strats to egg time. Everything. <laughs> Big Bang kind of sucks. 
There's like never really a reason to use it. See this? Egg time. Where, give me some health. Hey, give me health. Oh no. There we go. For some reason these guys are here. Oh, actually, I don't know why they're here. Because egg time. Alright, ready for the dumbest part of the game? Cause I am. Big Dino. And then it just plays Vegeta's theme. This is the most filler thing ever. The real Vegeta would just blow this up. Yeah, this is an escort mission. And you have to do one at a time. There is a strategy. Uh, if you're not Vegeta at this part, you're nuts. And if you're Piccolo, you're just absolutely nuts. That guy's so slow. So the strat is... Well, let me show you. Once you pick one of these up, you can't do anything. You can't fight back. I can't do anything. I can't go Super Saiyan. If I get hit, the egg is dead. But, it's just magically back for whatever reason. But here's the strat. You go up to it, you face it, you go Super Saiyan, and while you're going Super Saiyan, you pick it up, and you move. And then... Kind of just like... I mean, you don't have to go Super Saiyan. It just makes it a little easier. You hide over here. Oh, I messed that up. Alright, I haven't done this for a while. I'm trying to remember the pattern. I did most of that right. I guess you just have to be patient. Uh, you don't have to go Super Saiyan. It just makes it faster. Hey, remember that time Vegeta saved an entire dinosaur nest? Oh. <laughs> I looked away. <laughs> Playing Vegeta here is the icing on the cake. He would never do this. Yeah, I think the bottom route is also pretty good. It might actually be better. Uh, I think I tried it last time I played this. Oh, I messed up. Let's do this. Right, you ready? Oh. Yeah, I'm gonna try the bottom. Uh, it might be better. I've never tried it before, so we'll call this an experiment. I might be here a while, though, but...
Um, I think... First off, let me do this. I think the issue with the bottom path is that I'm probably just gonna, like, not know when to go. I'm so used to the top way. I have to do this three times. So this part's easy. I mean, it's all easy. It's just a matter of, like, remembering. If I hide over here, I think I remember now. Yeah. And then these guys are not threatening at all. Also, why can't he fight back? This is automatic, this walk. But uh, you just have to get past that screen three times. So once you do it once, it's fine. It's just dumb. Like, this is the least Dragon Ball Z thing I've ever seen. Of time. Look how slow this is. I just want to fight the androids, man. I messed that up like really bad. Give you, they give you this to, like, you know, heal up and everything, so it's never a threat. It's just... I don't know, I've complained enough. <laughs> I just have nothing else to talk about, except how dumb this is. Thankfully, after this, there's nothing really... Uh, yeah, yeah, there's, like, nothing else really on par with this. You do have to do like a hunt for the Dragon Balls later in the game, but that's kind of fun because it's like, you know, you're doing something. Um, this is easily the most tedious thing in the game though. It's pretty much non-stop plot after this though, so it's, it's, it's cool. There's, there's very little fillery stuff left. And the Dragon Ball hunt in this game is not that bad. Um, in Boost Fury, I swear it takes forever. I always that's that's my least favorite part of Boost Fury is the the Dragon Ball hunt chapter. It has some fun areas, but I don't know. It's just really. It's like I just want to get on with the plot. Oh, I might have messed it. Okay, good. Alright, we did it. It's over. <laughs>